Hello Aquarius! Thank you very much for tuning in to this week's read. For the main part of the read, I'm using Bonefire Tarot by Gabby Angus West. Website here is schifferbooks.com. Feel free to freeze frame and check that out if you're interested. Supportive Oracle Cards. Magical Spell Cards by Lucy Cavendish. Uh, illustrated by Jesse Reish, and there's a website at the bottom, hayhouse.com. Feel free to freeze frame and check that out if you're interested. What do we have for Aquarius? Victory. Okay. <laughs> um, what this is all centering around one situation. It's face down. I'm noticing. I almost feel like the situation it's revolving around. You're already over it, and I I don't feel like I really want to keep dealing with it. But it's here. So what is it? Ace of Swords fa face down. Page of Swords and the Six of Swords. So this is somebody who's very passive aggressive is what I'm getting. Um, somebody who has a lot of problems, but like they don't really deal with you directly. They cause problems behind the scenes. Um, this is somebody who causes problems behind the scenes. Ace of Swords face down is kind of telling me this person has a lot to say, just not to you directly. And I feel like this person tries to make it look like when you call them out that you're the problem and it's not them. They, they try to look like, I don't know, I've never said anything to Aquarius. I never never did anything to Aquarius. I don't know why Aquarius is like pointing me out. Um, meanwhile, they're saying stuff about you left and right behind your back. Um, okay. Now, this person has burned you in the past. Maybe you underestimated them. You didn't think they were that sharp. Uh, that's another thing with this person. It seemed like it was, it was a random moment. The conflict, yeah, five of wands. Conflict, and what is that? Is that the ten? Wheel of Fortune. Something just, I feel like, it just the way things played out, they burned you. You didn't think they were that sharp. I just feel like I didn't think they were that sharp. And then not only did I find out that they were, but that they're clearly not a fan of yours because they screwed you over. But it was kind of a gift in itself, kind of like you found out in the very beginning what this person really was like. I'm not going to say what they did was okay or that you liked that in any sort of shape or color, but finding out what they were really about, that, that was better to know than not know. You know. Um, not that you wouldn't have found it out over time anyway, but the way it came forward fairly quickly... I feel like I underestimated them. I just didn't think they were that sharp. And they burned you. And ever since then, you haven't wanted anything to do with them. But then this person, like, there's there's something up with this person. Uh, I feel like I need other people to know what they're really like. Um, because you're the one who has the structure behind this. Okay. Because um, this is... I also got like the Ten of Swords, like you don't really, you don't care for this person. That's what I'm getting from this. The Ten of Swords, you don't, you do not care for them. On the outward though, everybody else seems to think they're all peachy keen, sweet, and nice. And I feel like that even drives you even more mad. Because it's kind of like, other people think that this person's all the greatest, and they're so nice, and they're so fun, and they're like, no, they're not. You know, watch your back. You know, watch your back until they don't need you anymore, and then eh, you're going to get it. Um... When it comes to intellect, you are an air sign. You're the leader of the air signs. You know what you're doing. You know how to make people have a false sense of security if you want to. I'm not saying you did that. I'm not saying you should do that. But I'm saying if you want to, you easily can make that happen. To make somebody feel like you're not a problem or you're not watching. If you want people to think you're not watching, they will think you're not watching. Um... You've been watching for a while, and this person pushed the button, and you've been watching is what I'm getting. And you're waiting, because kind of like, I'm going to solve this, and when I solve it, I'm going to make sure I solve it on my terms. Destiny coming in with the Ace of Pentacles, they got you a long time ago. They burned your biscuits. 
They burned them. They were not edible. And you've been waiting ever since. You've been watching ever since, and you've been making them think that you don't pay attention to them at all. But you do pay attention, and you are aware of things. This is also somebody you don't want to deal with, but you are keeping your eye on. Just because you don't want to deal with them, just because you don't like them, doesn't mean you're, you're going to let them... No, you're, you're keeping your eye on them. Other people are also kind of like looking at the situation, and they seem to be catching up to this person. Because you're not the only person that's kind of gotten the negative side of this person. Aquarius is not the only person that's been manipulated by this person, whoever this is. Which they come across like this king of this knight of cups, but they're really kind of like they're really they're not that good. Um, other people have been burned by this person a little bit more subtle, but other people are starting to catch on here. You're not moving forward on that is what I'm getting. You're just kind of, you're, you're paying attention. You're paying attention and you see it. Are you doing it? You're not even doing this. Somebody else might beat you to the punch. I don't think you mind. Um, judgment coming in half in, half in, half out. And the three of swords half in, half out. Something's gonna happen real fast with this person other pe I think you're aware that other people are not happy, and this person has burned other people. Comes in really fast, this, and uh, there's a lot of stress for the person. Oh, there's a double card there. Okay, the Three of Swords behind the Ace of Cups. Yeah, the person that you're not very much a fan with, I feel like they're going to get what they deserve. They got the Three of Swords coming in. There's also the stress with the, the Nine of Swords coming in. It's kind of like, well, why is the Ace of Cups in there? I think that's how you, people are feeling this person, well, certain people like you and maybe a couple other people that got screwed over by this person are kind of like, yeah, that's right. Your turn came up. Looks like your number came up, bud. Enjoy. Because um, I feel like you're stepping, I don't feel like you're getting involved with it. I don't think you want to get involved with it, but I feel like you're very happy that this person's being seen for who they actually are. They should be seen for who they actually are. Um... After that, see, you don't have anything to do with that fallout. That's coming forward fairly soon. For some of you, it might be within six months. Others, it might be within the month you're seeing this, whatever that is. But it's coming. Um, I don't feel like it's on a time clock, like this specific moment, but it's coming. After that has happened, that's when, that's when things go your way. Because I feel like that's when you're going to kind of move forward. You got the ace... No, you got the Four of Wands and the Judgment in your favor. Be careful. <laughs> Be careful. Um, I don't know what's going on with it. No, we'll give it a second. You're gonna have. You're gonna be in a position to really make this person's life difficult. Um, be careful. If you want to remind people what they're like and you want to move them out of your way, I feel like that makes sense. Don't get caught up in the revenge. It makes sense why you would want to. But I feel like that could create a life of its own. Um, you're going to be in a position for things to work out for you. I feel like you're going to point out this person every now and then when you need to. So it goes to your advantage. So people see you for who you are and them for who they are. And you're like, you're not going to let people forget that. Just be careful. Less is more. Um... You might attract the wrong people if you're not careful. I just keep getting, like, people might warm up to you that you don't really want warming up to you. Um, so after the fact, you won't let people forget. Like, oh, remember, you know, the king, of, the knight of cups, not so, not so cuppy. Not so cuppy. That cup's full of crap. Not wine. Crap. Um, so you'll, you'll remind people, but be careful. Don't, don't highlight it too much. You're going to attract people you don't really want is what I'm getting. Um, say your piece, make sure people know where you stand and who they are, yes. But, uh, like, I'm trying to remember, I'm trying to get there, like, I'm trying to remember something. I don't know, I just feel like, see, the, that's the two, which is, that's the three of earth reversed, that's the three of pentacles reversed, and the empress reversed. You're going to end up connecting to people you don't really want in your life. That person has made some enemies. Um, n 
the enemy of my enemy is not my friend in this. I would just be careful. Because I feel like you're going to bond with people. You might end up bonding with people that are not... They're not really good for you. Just because this person screwed you over and a couple other people... Those other people, just because they got screwed over too, doesn't mean they're also good people. Just... I don't know. I'm just... They're warning you. Don't bond with that afterwards. If you can... You know, enjoy that moment when this person gets what they deserve. I, I don't feel any problem with that, personally. Like, enjoy the moment like you need to. But I would stay out of it and just... And you got to say what you got to say at the right time. I get that. But don't bond with people who this person also screwed over. Just don't do it. I'm getting like that's going to lead you to a place that's not going to be good. I just feel like that's not going to go well for you. Um, you might end up pulling some snakes close to you and not realize that they're snakes either. Like this one got past you. These other ones might get past you too for the wrong reason. Just be careful of that is what I keep getting. Um, keep your distance. It's better to keep a distance. And especially because, like, they might be smart people like you too. So there might be that intellect bond. But, like, I don't know. I'm just hopefully I'm saying that right. Just remember, just because people have the same enemy doesn't mean they're a friend. Like, you know what I mean? Just because they don't like this person and you don't like this person, just be careful. Just be very careful with that. All right, I'm going to shut this down here. I hope that helps. Thank you for watching. If you'd like a direct reading from me, shoot me an email, jamesforastral at gmail.com. That's james, the number four. Astral at gmail.com. If you're interested in the donation information, that's below. Same email. Thank you very much for watching and have a great day.